Well, howdy there, everybody. Take a break from your continuing E3 coverage and welcome back to the video game. Super awesome, super awesome video game show. Here at Rage Select, I'm Jeff. I'm John. Did you just forget the name of this goddamn show? No, I just forgot to put the super awesome on front. And I, I quickly realized this is not just some kind of regular old show. This is a super awesome show, all right? so Super awesome video game show. That's damn right. It's you know, God right here damn. on Rage So, yeah, we're playing uh, Dreadnought uh, came into beta on the PlayStation yeah. today. And I bought it. It's one of those things where you got to buy your way into the beta. So I'm going to buy this Vanguard bundle because I got the, the GPs to do it. And um, spin those GPs. Yep. I got the PCF uh, Celestia. Kick out, kickstart your merch. Just progress faster with seven days of elite status. Command the powerful hero ship and get 10,000 credits. The tech tree, the Vanguard bundle contains everything you need to become a legend. Uh, you know what? Fuck a bunch of that. Let's just go play this. Like, okay, so. Uh, sure, 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 sure. Uh, so yeah, we went through the tutorial on this, and for those of you who have forgotten, I wouldn't, I wouldn't blame you because vanguard has been or uh dreadnought was announced like they had that kick-ass trailer at e3 like what was it like three years ago two like or three the, i don't the know big ship comes down in front of the fighters and yeah. then it's like I don't know. dreadnought and then it was announced it was going to be a multiplayer adversarial online game and yeah, i remember like, there was a, a thing about it not at e3 last year but at the last sony press conference oh this yeah last one in december okay there was a big presentation about it like it was one of the things they touched on during their Sony event okay. thing, or Sony Expo. Uh, I mean, I played it a little bit at an Intel station at South by Southwest like two years ago. Yeah. They seem to be... I know that Twitch, there's apparently a fair number of people on Twitch, like streamers on Twitch that do it, uh, that have been doing the beta, because um, you can find footage for it all over the place, but it's just like a little strange. So, um, all right. So, we got our Ago, Agus, Agusta... Okay, uh, we got some repeater turrets and some modules and some stats. Okay, oh, okay. So we could we're here. We're choosing our ship. Um, so which ship should we should we we've got the oh? Did you just did you just oh no okay no it's it out. So uh, got here's the, the Rurik and artillery cruiser. Okay, we've got the magic the wand Cerberus, uh, uh, tactical cruiser. Okay. Uh, what is the different views? Okay. Oh shit, we're getting ready. We got a countdown up there. Yeah, we did. Ten seconds. Uh, we got a dreadnought tier one. Let's just go with this Ag Agatha. The, the Ag Rus R okay, yeah. Destroyer. Ag Agosta. Yeah. Um, kind of looks like a, a helicarrier. Yeah, a little bit. It's got a lot of like space on the top of it where yeah. you can like walk around. Um. So yeah, this is if you never really have paid any attention to this, this is like. Multiplayer, adversarial, um, like four on four or five on five or, or something like that. Um, kind of big ship driving game. Filling a niche which I don't know really actually exists in gaming. Um, uh, there's a lot of Inception noises going on here, John. Yeah, it was like, uh, are these like Reaper noises or Inception noises? Or? Okay, there we go. So it's kind of interesting because it is different. I mean, like, it's definitely a different type of game than what we're used to, like, especially in a multiplayer way that it's yeah different uh, but strange. Um, real big, slow-moving ships that have different kind of, like, loadouts and such. Um, you can see down there that my – I've got um, four different things in oh, my loadout. Shit. Some of your uh – Torpedoes. Turrets got destroyed, right? Uh, I don't know. Uh oh. Let's let's put our things to shields. Uh oh shit. Oh okay. You're going down. Julian Bissett just killed me, you guys. I don't know who that is. Um. Okay. Damn you, Julian! So let's keep up. Let's keep up with this. So oh shit. It looks like the uh the enemies or or the other team is winning right now. I thought that I was at least doing a little bit of damage. Um, see, let's put this all into. Let's see if I can support my guy over here with. So, are these actual other players or are these bots? I, they, I think they're bots. Um, For this specific match. Yeah, I think they're bots. I'm gonna put my. Um, 
So on the left hand side of the screen, we've got our our um, uh, that's our health, and on the right hand side, we've got our shields. Uh, down in the bottom right hand corner, like I said, we've got different modules that respawn over time. Um, so for this one, I've got some, and I've got my shield that I can put the shields up. Um, oh fuck. We got missiles incoming. Uh, I've got protean uh -oh. rail guns. Oh, I feel like this one doesn't have any uh, any real um, like defensive measures on it. Yeah. Uh, like the other one that we had in training had. So I feel like I'm hitting this thing, right? You are. Its health is going down. Okay. Like it just got destroyed. Okay. Let's shoot some torpedoes. Um, it's kind of nifty. I mean, it feels like it's very esoteric. Like it's different than a lot of other games. Um, oh, take Julian down, Jeff. I gotta do it, man. I gotta Even get if revenge. it's a bot, you gotta, you gotta. I gotta get revenge for. Oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh fuck! I don't You're think going we're gonna down. make this. Yep. Yep. Uh, uh, there it goes. Bam! Or it's 20 to 32. Am I here with other people? Because I feel like I just got a bunch of... Oh, those are all assists. Okay. Uh, let's try some of the other ones. Maybe that's... Uh, maybe we can get a different ship, and that'll be what we need. So here we've got a heavy Tesla cannon. We've got flechette missiles, siege mode, two anti-missile launchers, and stationary cloaks. We have a cloaking field? Oh, shit! Um... They're all real slow. It's actually kind of interesting to think about, like, a, uh, the way that a lot of multiplayer games for, you know, for video games are, generally speaking, very quick, right? So, uh, whoa, is that, oh, it's like a sniper rifle. So my, why am I, oh, oh, I've got to face the ship in the direction because this one shoots from the actual bow. Yeah, so I've got to aim it. Yeah! All right. Suck so it. maybe long range is where Jeff needs to be, right? I put myself into siege mode. Does that mean I can shoot, like, faster? Am I hitting? Oh, shit. Yeah! I like this one. Stay away from the battle, John. Yeah? Just fucking shoot the AI from a distance. Snipe! Yeah, who would have thought that uh, the only place that Jeff was any good at, at playing a sniper was at a game where you're driving big fucking ships, big fuck-off dreadnoughts all over the place. Oh, wait, got to turn my bow a little bit here. I like, that, I like that this ship is different enough that you have to, like, aim it via the bow instead of you can't just... Yeah, it's the ships are all different enough that they play differently. You know, there's different aspects to them. That's kind of cool. This is definitely, yeah, fucking dirty sniper over Suck here. It. Uh, we're nay, hey, we're up to 44 over 10 now. We we stopped losing. Uh, there should be another one over here. God, There's also you know, to your yeah. Oh wait, that's the one that I probably want to focus on right now. So uh, the only problem that I'm having right now is that like just like a lot of really kind of technical multiplayer games, there appears to be some kind of esoteric bullshit going on here that I don't entirely understand. Like like, like what. Like, we just got a thing here called Siege Mode, and I don't know what that does, like, when I activate it. So it gives me, like, one big hit. Oh, okay. All right. There we go. Give it a shot, why don't you, Jeff? Like, maybe try it out before you start shit-talking. Okay, I don't think that guy's in range. Oh, but wait, we got another one over here. Let's move it around to BAM! I don't know, you know, um... I feel like, you know, of all the things in video games, John, that multiplayer tends to be one of those really kind of like monolithic things that doesn't change all that much over the yeah. years. Like that we get hooked in on one thing. Like it was MOBAs for a while and now it's kind of like, well, what it was, it was, everything was Call of Duty for a little while and then we had a whole bunch of MOBAs and now we're into Overwatch clones, right? Yeah. Um, the, our, the team arena deathmatch. Yeah. So I like this ship quite a bit. I feel like if I was playing against other players that it would be quite a bit different. Can I hit those missiles from here? Those little fouchette missiles? Or is that like the pistol? Oh shit, he's a sniper too. Yep. Reload! Scratch one artillery cruiser. It feels more like World of Tanks at this point. Yeah, does have that vibe a little bit. 
So uh, it seems like, is this going to come out and be free to play? I have no idea. Because generally speaking, when you get this whole like, oh, you buy the Founders pack, and then when the game comes yeah, out, that, that typically it'll be free. But if you want to get in on the beta, then it'll be, oh, shit, Founders pack. I'm going to back up a little bit from this BS. Well, we're winning. Yeah, that's good. I don't know. What do you think, John? Do you think that you would ever be interested in playing a game like this? Like on your just in your spare time? I don't think so. Because I've got, man, I got a lot of love for big ass sci fi spaceships. It's like almost exclusively what I read is fiction about big ass sci fi spaceships. Yeah. But this, this actually seems really cool. And I, I just, I, it's a little too s uh, slow moving yeah. for me, if that makes sense. Sure. I can see that. Um, I mean, it was maybe a little bit like we should if I get killed, then we can go check out maybe a different class. I do kind of like the idea of using like at first I was a little bit upset that this wasn't just like in deep space, but I could see where that would be make this a lot more difficult. Um, come on, blast them. I wonder if they have different like weak points on the ships. That's also a good possibility. I like, guess there's such a thing as a headshot. Boom. Bridge shot. Yeah, shoot him in the bridge. Here's another. Oh, that's one of our artilleries. Man, there. God damn. Are, do they just have like an inception noise generator somewhere on this planet? Because there's a lot of inception noises just happening. Oh, shit. That guy healed. Kind of siege up or whatever. I already did that. Oh, I'm trying right that. now to to um, take this guy out before I get taken out by somebody else. I'm going to drive up to him. And then I'm going to cloak my way out of that. Oh, I wanted the kill shot. What about you, little buddy? Oh, well. And you don't have any other weapons other than just the one sniper on this? Well, no, I have. I mean, like, all of, the, all of them have, like, a primary gun. Oh, no, wait, hold on. Uh, yeah, see, I've got light flak turrets that are a little bit closer. And then I've got, let's see, heavy Tesla cannon. I feel like that's what I was shooting before, right? And yeah. then I've got, yeah, so everybody, okay, that's that. Oh, man, I got the most kills on this entire server, y'all. Oh, fuck, I'm almost dead, too. Let me try to cloak my way out of here. Get a little, a little high ground. Come on, Anakin, don't do it. Don't do it, Anakin. No way, you're not disappearing in my house, you jerk. Oh, fuck. Maybe he is. Wait, is that... Okay. I don't know how you get back. I guess you'd regenerate health. Like you can see my health going back up there, so... Yeah. Well, I would assume you have a crew that's repairing the ship as it's... Oh, shit! Who's got some? Ah, uh, that guy, apparently. So, John, I, I'm, I'm, as the moment we're recording this, I'm very sad. Yeah. I just learned that there's no, going to be no Death Stranding at E3 this year. No. Instead, they had a really cryptic picture of a spider web that's yep. in the shape of a star with the pentagram, pentagram, yeah. You know, yep. With the Pentagon shape in it and the word bridges. Yep. Bridges. So, you guys heard it here first. It's a Bridges to Madison County video game. Yeah. That's what we're doing. Oh, no. Trust me. There's been a lot of theories. I even made a really long joke post about it. Uh... Where are, I can't even see what I'm shooting at over here. Maybe pull down a little bit. Try to use a little bit of the, the. So you can also you can switch your um, your kind of. So like this is power to engines makes me go faster. Power to shields we got kind of like default power and then power to weapons. Um, missiles. Uh oh. Whoops. Turned my ship the wrong way. Yay, we won! Sniper Someone rifle Someone called ship. that a, a win. So now we get to go out and uh, see just how bad it is when you play against other humans, which I feel bad about. Yeah. Not good. I would, pl I would probably sit here by myself and play this, where you're just playing with other people against the computer and just be like, Woo, let's all go kick the computer's ass! I don't like playing against other people. They're too good! Ah. <laughs> uh. Why right. just? I just don't know why we can't just get like a single player game that's kind of like this. I feel like there's a few on the PC, but they're all like, they're okay, you know, but not the best. Um, all right, so let's take a look at our uh, what do we got here? 
Aegis. This is the one that we were... Yeah, okay, so let's try customize. Oh, my God, look at this. Oh, shit, can we put fucking... Can we put rage ears on it? Can I put rage like flames on this motherfucker? What? Okay, blue, blue, white and blue. That's kind of sporty. Dragon blue. Oh, that takes cashola. So, okay. Cosmetic cashola. Uh, how about a pattern? What do we got here? Does that say Festivus? It does. And splinter camo. That's pretty... Oh, man, that's pretty hot. That also takes yeah. money. We got an emblem here. We're going to put hunter emblem none the kraken we can release a kraken oh shit G geneva the reaper i don't fear it T tanzer his flurge schmigadoo Sh 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 um all right can we can we go back over to oh wait no i want to i want to just want to go to this ship customize okay Oh, okay, so what I really wanted to do was uh, rename Tech Tree, coming soon, change ships, remove from fleet. Okay, so if we go to the Tech Tree for this, we've got, um, we've actually got a big chunk of another currency up there, the great stuff yeah, yeah. that you can use to unlock. So here's Siege Mode. Okay, max damage, blast radius, self-effects. So then we've got Siege Mode 1. And what is this? This is another cruiser that we can unlock. Let's just try. So if we unlock, wait, hold on. Uh, if we unlock siege mode, oh, I don't have enough. Oh, that's stars. Oh wait, but I can do. Can I? Oh, it takes research and it takes cashola. Yeah. So we need to go play some games first. Yes. All right. So let's go do that. Uh, play. So we got versus. We got co-op versus AI training and coming soon. So let's do. Let's just do straight up versus, man. Let's do team deathmatch. Recruits. Thanks, Good job, man. Bix. Do we can also I change our care. Oh, never mind. We found a found. We're found a game. Found a game. Game on. This is the same place though. This is the Kappa base. I wonder if we've got. Um, is there another map in this beta, or if it's all coming soon? It may just be this map. Yeah, it's a possibility. Okay. Hmm. I mean, there was the tutorial area oh yeah yeah that was out in space yeah i feel like oh. they they probably had an issue where they started by just having it because it was that pc game that we were going to do for early access one time that was just space fights it was this but it was in space and it was an early access game and it was just pvp and it was big carriers and it had a had a name like dreadnought it was called like carrier space or something i'm gonna be honest i don't remember you don't know okay uh i know i i actually know the game but i don't remember what the title was okay I, um, I do remember playing it. Okay, so let's... Uh, should we try something different than the one that we've been doing? Yeah, let's try a different one. Let's, Cerberus is... We should have listened to the guy talk about what every one of them was. Yeah. Repair rate. Okay, energy, primary show, loadout. We've got medium beam turrets, Tesla turrets, modules, beam amplifier, repair pod, auto repair, repair auto beams. Oh, this is a medic. Okay. Uh, that's always good for noobs, right? Get yourself a medic. Be the medic. We've got Dreadnought Tier 1. This is heavy plasma cannons, plasma, anti-missile launcher, warp jump. I think like a scoutish type of thing. And then we've got the Celestia, rapid fire mode, missile, disruptor pulse, and armor amplifier. You know what? Let's try to keep ourselves alive. Oh, shit. I really hope that I got... Let me take this one. I like the little, little rotating eyeball things on it. Yeah. All right, medium beam turrets. We got beam amplifier. We got repair pods, repair auto beams. So that's my primary, and I've got Tesla turrets, medium beam turrets. Okay, and then I've got. Uh oh, somebody's already shooting at me. So if I do repair auto beam on my buddy over here, then it should keep him alive, right? Yep. Or at least somewhat. He's getting real hammered. God damn. Ah, uh, he's dead. Yeah, well. You weren't a very good medic. I, I was trying to repair him, but he basically just, like, marched headfirst into the entire enemy team. So I don't know if I'm even hitting anything here. I don't feel like I'm hitting this guy at all. Is that like a health bubble thing? Um, I just don't feel like I'm I'm hitting. God damn! Like, 
Okay. Wow. That was not good for me. Let's try a different one. Let's try a different one. We're going to be fucking up our team this time anyway, so we might as well get it all out of our system. Select ship, spawn. I mean, they're just they're just owning the shit out yeah, of us. Yeah, they are. <laughs> heavy right. plasma cannons. All right, let's do it. Let's plas let's heavy some plasma. Okay, and what else do we have? Repeater guns. Okay, that's like close in, right? Vulture missiles, anti missiles, warp jump. So let's try warp jumping right into the middle of them. Okay. Oh, is he already shooting at you? Yeah. I need to actually put my shields up so if I can get closer. I feel like this is one of the... If he's like one of those other ones, then he might um, actually... This might be great because if I can get in close to him, it means that uh, I can... He's, he's not going to be as well put together as I am. Oh, wait. Hold on. Let's try the other guns. Anti-missiles, anti-missiles, anti-missiles. Ah, uh, fuck. Yeah, don't let that guy's uh, the front of that guy's ship point at you. Blow him up! Oh, I'm trying. I'm reloading. I'm reloading. Yeah, I got him. Uh, uh, fuck. You got someone yep, behind you? Yep, I'm trying to warp jump out to repair. Nope, yeah, he they killed just me. went right up your ass and shot as much as they could. Yep, well. Hey, man, at least I killed one guy. Uh, let's try the PFC Celestia. So it seems like that Simarl or whatever was like a pretty decent, like, medium-grade ship, right? Yeah. Um, this guy has drain missiles, disruptor pulse, armor amplifier. This actually seems like a... Um, uh, okay, like a... Um, uh, like a status, like a debuff, right? Okay. Because I don't know what drain missiles are, but I assume that they have something to do with not just, like, direct damage. Let's put the... No. Let's try to go through this canyons, John. Keep some canyons in between us and them. Maybe we can come around behind whoever Sparky over here is. Uh-oh. Coming whoa. under the radar. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dreadnought. Okay, uh, let's... What is this, Tokyo Drift? I'm drifting this Dreadnought all over the goddamn place. Yeah, drain him. Oh, he went into cloak. He's trying to get a lock on me. Uh... He almost got him. Almost! Die! Yep. He fucking fucked me up, but I, I got him. I can get out of here and heal a little bit. Nope, nope, nope. That wasn't what I meant to do. Hey, medic! Medic! Wait, is that the enemy team? Oh, no, that's my team. So, okay. Trying to keep me alive. Who the fuck is shooting at me? Hey, I'm back up to full health. Look at that. Yeah, because the medic came in. Yeah. yeah. Okay, uh, armor amplifier. I probably should have used that. Uh, okay, hold on. Let's see. What do I got here? Particle turrets and machine gun turrets. Okay, particle turrets. Can I shoot this thing from here? Oh, fuck. I just got blasted by one of the snipers. There's a bead on me. Oh, nice. Yeah, he kind of seems like Sniper City. I mean, until you kind of get used to it. But yeah. they're really tearing us up here. Uh, let's go back to the old sniper. I kind of like that one that we were just doing, but uh, let's just tr let's try see if we can get a few hits in. Um, Don't forget to turn your. Yeah, I know. Uh, oops, wasn't needed. Unnecessary. Okay. I, there's no strafing, which is kind of interesting for a, yeah. a online game. 
Where the hell are they? Oh, they're like way over there, huh? Okay, put power to the engines. Let's go up a little bit. See if we can get a beat on them. It's kind of nifty, right? Yeah. Though it's a little yeah. different, little little different than your average. Like I said, a little slow for my taste, but I can totally see the appeal. Did you get him? Ah, uh, nah. you missed. The thing is, there, red. there we go. One more should do it. Oh, uh, he's going down. Oh, oh, so close. I think it's I can soften him up a little bit, right? Yeah. Incoming, Captain. From where? What's with the what's with the horns? Is that just the soundtrack? Yeah. Oh shit. Okay. This guy's coming over to fuck my world up. Uh fuck. I, I turned I turned John. Yeah, that's uh, that's not gonna be good for you, dude. Damn, alright, well, I think this other team is just like people who've been playing this game. <laughs> yeah, well of course. Uh let's see. What was I I really liked this ship right here for just kind of like medium. Why are, what, all of our guys are on using the same type of ship at this point? So this one is plasma broadside, vulture missiles, anti-missile launchers, warp jump. Oh, wait, shit, there's a guy right behind me. Fuck me. Power to engines, power to engines, 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 engines. Oh, wait, shit. Who's shooting at my boy over here? Shoot him in the face! I'm actually jumping to his oh. coordinates. Oh, fuck. I want to jump over there. Oh, fuck. Well, wait, 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 wait. God damn. All right. If I can try to get an alpha the sniper. Yeah, they're both coming for you. Trying to flank you. This is like a battle of attrition. Like, yeah. who's going to get it? I think I'm going to get it. I think I'm going to get it, John. Oh, fuck me. Yeah, I got it. Payback. Right. Oh, shit. There was another one right there the whole time. Fuck. Yeah, that's the, the two of them. Warp jump. Uh, take them with me. Warp jump. Turn on my shields. Oh. <laughs> whoops. 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 Went into the ground. I don't know. You know what? Yeah. If this was free to play, I can see like being like, yeah, let's do it. Except for the fact that this also seems like a game that has so much specialty to it that if you try to go in as a new, but like it's kind of like trying to come into Call of Duty right now, right? Yeah. Like where you're just going to get fucked. You're going to get fucked all the live long day and there ain't nothing you can do about it. So I really want to see if I can find their sniper and warp to them since I have the warp capability with this ship. Um, let's see. So I'm kind of curious how warping works. Do I just warp to where I'm pointing? I don't know. Let's take a look at the map. Sort of, I guess, is the answer. All power to engines, y'all. Oh, well, you know what? Uh, we're yeah. actually right around 30 minutes, yeah, so yeah, yeah. I feel like this is probably as good as any, like, an introduction to people to Dreadnought. Um, there are people online that are obviously way better. We were defeated! We were defeated by them. This is a bunch of just guys. So we got 97, uh, or we got, yeah, we got elite, st see, we got, a, I'm an elite status because I put money into this. <laughs> Uh, five percent of the team, and then we got ship XP. Oh, okay, so we got individual XP applied to individual ships that we can use to level up. So let's take a quick look and see can we actually level something up. But you know what? The fact that you can play versus AI, I don't think that I would have a bad time just playing versus AI with a bunch of other people because that was fun. Yeah. And like, you don't have to deal with people who are just super, super goddamn good at this video game. Um, so let's take a quick look at this. Yep. Uh, nope, nope, no, no, no. I don't want to do this. Uh, let's see. So let's see if we go to uh, this. There she is. Dreadnought class. Yay! She doesn't move too fast, but she's lined from bow to stern with heavy armor and filled to the gunnels with firepower. So she doesn't. Ooh, look at that. It's saucy. A dreadnought size makes her a pretty easy target on the battlefield. Watch your positioning. And always keep one eye on the smaller... Ah, oh, dude, put the Kraken on the front. Anything with long range firepower. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Look at that thing. Wow, that's incredible. I really want that. Wait, I can have it. Yeah. Because it's part of the thing. Okay, so there's different bows, but I can... I can oh, shit, yeah! That is fucking rock and rolling! All right. Wait, hold on. Let's do that again. Oh, I like the way that you can customize each individual little piece of your ship. Yeah, that's actually kind of cool. Uh, let's see. How about the this one? Okay. I think I prefer a smaller bridge, personally. How about the stern? What do we got? Okay. Morning star or none. Uh, all right. So let's see. Um, officer briefings. We don't have that yet. Let's take a look at this tech tree. So we haven't. I don't think we've earned enough of the things yet to level up. But let's see. If we look at this. So the repeater gun in. And then this one has a higher. What's 2400 to 3400 DPR clip size? Okay, so you level up, and then once you level up enough, then you get the, like, a different version of it. Okay. Um, research required. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, you know what? Um, that's that's probably about as much as anything. Yeah. Uh, we've got our different tech trees. Uh, we haven't even looked at, like, what the legendary, buy two more ships of the Tier 4 or higher to unlock legendary fleet. Uh, veteran fleet, so you can buy ships. Okay. Okay. Um, anyway, uh, that's as good as anything. So, hey, folks, um, thanks for watching. This has been the Super Awesome Video Game Show. We tend to look at betas, a lot of times early access, or sometimes just some other stuff, uh, just other things that we feel like looking at. So, um, yeah, let us know down in the comments what you think of Dreadnought. Uh, and um, we also have a Patreon, patreon.com forward slash rage select. You can check us out. And, uh, yeah, we will catch you next time. See ya. Yeah.